Hey there, Jack Zan here. Just uh, got this new Detective Pikachu. Thought I'd show this off. And as you can see, he's kind of the uh, EX uh, Pikachu, I guess. I don't know. I don't know that much about Pokemon. <laughs> uh, but he definitely is gigantic compared to them. I mean, look at Charizard. Charizard's a big Pokemon, right? I'm just kidding. These are from the... Uh, Super Mario Smash, so they all have to be, uh, you know, kind of similar size, but here's a good look at Little Pikachu and Gigantic uh, Detective Pikachu. Okay, so I just thought I would uh, show, off, show it off before I unboxed it. Right now it acts like you can only use it in uh, the Detective Pikachu game. Hopefully it can be used for something else. Uh, down the line or with uh, games you already have I guess maybe it'll add a hat on this uh, some other previous game I don't know okay let me open this uh, sucker up and get a better look at it ooh this tail is pretty big so be careful when you're uh, pulling out that tail there Let's see if I can uh Prop up my camera here. There you go. I pulled out pretty easy. And there he is. Gigantor Pikachu. And for some reason I lost focus. Here we go. Is that a little bit better? There's Pikachu with his ginormous tail. All the same printing on the bottom, just a wee bit bigger there. Make sure I get some better lighting there. Ooh, glossy. Alright. Pikachu has his little detective hat on. It's basically like the old school uh, Sherlock Holmes. Or, you know, as people like to see Sherlock Holmes. Actually Sherlock Holmes wore kind of like a more like a top hat, dress hat. And there's the difference uh, difference in size between the two. Rawr. Hello daddy. Rawr. Hello son. <laughs> I was trying to get him to hold him here. I don't know he'd be on his back like this. Whee! Hey, Dad, let's go for a ride. Okay, that's kind of crazy. But, you know, not a whole lot of de detail with these uh, these Pokemon. Well, he can. He's got a spot for his mouth since he's big enough. <laughs> Put your finger in his mouth. Indentations. Looks like the eyes are actually uh, stickers. I don't think those are painted on. <clears throat> or maybe they are painted on. Yeah, I guess it could be spot painted on. Probably like four processes. And on the base there, it looks like he's got like a little map. I like that, that they change up the bases. And good thing with uh, this uh, Amiibo, he's, he's got enough of a... Uh, you know, his feet touch the surface enough where he doesn't have to have any extra thing holding him. My gosh, look at the size of his feet. Are they really that tiny? Yeah, I guess so. Okay, I guess that's proportionally correct. Yep. And there's his backside with his tails with a couple extra stripes. And one stripe on his tail. So that's about it. I mean, I don't know how much detail you can get out of a Pokemon. They're pretty... You know, pretty flat colored. Um, but the hat's pretty cool. It's also a plastic uh, texture. you think it might have some, I don't know, actually cloth fabric, but it's not. It's just plastic and made to look like fabric. But a uh, very well job, uh, job very well done there. All right, cool. I just thought I'd show that off real quick. Uh, it's the newest Amiibo out. 
and just wanted to share that with everyone. Thanks for watching, and please subscribe, and comment below. Later.